We are headed to Bill Manor, a house with rich history, as well as well-documented claims of the paranormal. As usual, when we travel to these haunted locations, we want to go and we want to find new claims, as well as new information that we can add to the history that's already there. Daisy's room here, actually. Holy cow. There's a little bit of a creepy feeling in here. Yeah, this yeah. was the room where there are claims that she did pass away at. That's pretty freaking nuts. Yes, it is. Baseline reading right now through this whole hallway and into the entry room here. Main staircase. Let's go up here. These, this staircase, there's claims of the uh, red-headed boy. I mean, I wonder if it's the one that passed away here and nobody knows how he passed away so that could be if he fell down his steps or still just a baseline reading right now what do you got nicole anything no i haven't had a single spike yet so up here is where there's claims of shadow figures running around so one of these windows is where they've seen an old man looking out of one of these windows in the rooms also claims of a male cough there's some so, kind of coughing noise yeah. It feels like there's somebody laying in that bed when you... I thought that too when I was taking pictures. Got a baseline reading here. Oh, got something? Yeah, just a tiny little one here, guys. Oh, yeah. Got a little something going on here. People sit here and right. one person has seen a little kid that appeared. Another person saw an older lady with a bun on her head. An older okay. lady? Could that be Daisy? Could be. Could be Daisy. Or could there be another woman in here? We'll try to see if we can find out. This place used to be a funeral parlor, so. Okay, so. Like a little one. This is the attic where there's claims of heavy footsteps up here, as well as like shuffling around from feet, at least sounds of feet. Another spot, they say they see that redheaded boy, so. For the most part, baseline readings, but we're definitely getting some unexplainable spikeage here. Watch your step now. It just feels like somebody is waiting for us to come down here. To the basement? Yeah. And one thing to keep in mind, this is the area in this basement somewhere where the biter and the scratcher is. Mm -hmm. So we can think maybe it's a child, but we don't really know, you know? So this makes me want to believe that this might be a pretty relevant area, especially with all the chairs and stuff set up. I wonder exactly what happens in this room compared to the other ones. 1966 is whenever it was claimed that she passed away in this room. So let's see if we can't capture her on the SLS or get her to get you to light up one of these K2s. Hey Daisy, if you are uh, still currently here with us, we are in your room right now. Can you please show yourself? We have a device that will allow us to see you. All you gotta do is walk in front of it. So Daisy, there are a lot of claims of you interacting since this was your room. We would love for you to interact with us. We have a couple devices that will allow you to interact. Can you please go over and manipulate one of those for us, please? like a camera clicking almost from like right in this area but there's no there's nothing whoa 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 right here you got some right here right by where nicole was talking about the clicking see this? yeah i keep this hearing like a here. clicking oh thing. shit it disappeared she's like it back Wait, no. Oh, uh, right there. Oh. Daisy, if that's you, can you wave to us? Looks like it's getting closer to the chair. Right in here. Right in here. Let me see if I back away a little bit. Gives her a little bit of room. She's, it looks like it's trying to reach out to the chair. No, right on the oh, chair. Oh, watch the K2. Because it just Oh, it just went off. Where did you said that? Captured. Okay, can you touch that again? Okay. Here we go. Daisy, where'd you go? 
Oh, I have the Hold chills. On. It literally reached okay. up and touched okay. the K2. Pan this way some. Away from Josh. That's a mirror. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Was something right in there? Yeah. Right in the bathroom? There it is. There it is. Right on They're top like of each right other. They're right on top of each other. Is that Daisy and Clarence? There it is. There's two there, just a little yeah. bit ago. Is that Daisy and Clarence? Try putting the K2 in the bathroom. Here Hi, Nicole. Is there still something there? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, Daisy or Clarence, we don't know who we're talking to, but you see that device we just sat on the floor? Can you go over and touch it for me, please? Whoa, wow, that was freaking insane, dude. I missed it too. <laughs> uh, Thank you, can you do that again? Here, Nicole, step back. Yes, yeah. that was crazy. Okay. All right, so if this is Daisy, can you do it for me, please? I think we got a decent response from that K2 after we asked it. Plus, we got the, got it to touch it while it's on its chair, you know? Yeah. Josh, did you say you captured that? It was pointing at it. Hey, hey. I got it. All right, so right now we're getting Rempod action. Are we communicating with the little boy that they say looks red that they see climbing up and down these stairs? Is this the little boy with red hair? If so, can you touch one of our devices? We have a teddy bear up there. Cheers. I just heard like a kid laugh, like a, like a little child laugh. In my own ears, actually. It's almost like it's like messing with us. Well, don't forget they run up and down the hall up there, so they might be playing. Can you please come over and touch one of our devices? They'll make a cool noise and light up for you. There it is, there it is, yes. Are you the little boy that passed away? Whoa. That's right. It's touching it. Anyway. Yeah, it's grabbing it. Yeah. Because whenever I set it off, I have to grab the antenna for it to be like that. Yeah. Maybe he thinks it's a toy. It is a toy. Do you like that device? If you do, you can keep playing with it. Do you enjoy us being here right now, trying to talk with you and interact? Whoa! Damn. On the DVR right Shh. before that. Did you hear that? I just heard a child's voice. Can I come sit right here on the steps with you? 
If so, can you touch that device again? Do you want us to come and find you? Can you please make that device go off? Do you mind if I come a little closer? All you gotta do is light that up when you want me to stop and I'll stop. Are you standing here with me? If you are, can you light this up for me, please? Can you make it light up the colors? What if we take this toy upstairs with us? Will you follow us upstairs? If so, can you light it up different colors? So we did a lot after this point and did not capture anything noteworthy. We tried the session with almost all of our equipment at the top of the stairs, did an EVP session in the attic, tried a session in the bedrooms. We also did a spirit box session in the basement. We got some answers, but nothing that was relevant. We even tried to sleep in the beds for a few hours to see if any activity would happen, but the activity all but seemed to stop. So after all of that, at 5 a.m., we went back to the stairs to try and communicate with possibly the redheaded boy through the spirit box. We're gonna try and see if we can't come to communication with the little boy that we came in communication with earlier with our REM pod. We're gonna see if we can't get him to talk to the SC methods for us. So we would like to know what your name is to the boy we were communicating with earlier. Cold. Boy, please come and talk with us. Play with some of our toys. We have help for you. We have that red light at the top. Home. What is it? Home. That red light at the top of the steps. Can you go over and touch it? We got some. Again. Again. Yeah, actually, yes. Home. Do, was this your home at one point in time? Is that what you're referencing? If it is, can you go over Tomorrow. And make one of these motion balls go off or that REM pod that you did earlier, please. Can you tell me which bedroom you stayed in when you lived here? Motion ball right there. That might be an indication. If that is you, can you please make a different motion ball go off? All you gotta do is do the same thing you just Quick. Did. Okay, like 
lifted something up quick. Love. Can you make another motion ball light up? Can you maybe the one on the first step there, please? What about the little red light at the top of the step? Sounded like kids laughing. Of toys out there for you guys. You can all play with them. All you gotta do is go over and touch them, get close to them, they'll light up. Run. Are you running around? Somebody. Can you run? Love. Up? Can you run up and down the steps for me, please? Maybe. I don't know. He's got the flashlight, but not that light. Come over and touch this one. All you do is get close to it. About. Did you just show you? Please show us whatever you'd like. Four. Four. It's four of us. Can you tell me how many there are of you? Can you a number? Young. Young. Preacher. Oh, okay. Oh, all right. Were you a preacher? Were you the one Rumor. Who would do the ceremonies here back when it was a funeral home? you were when you died open baby, baby. John oh, a name. is John a name of, the, of one of the babies that was here is there cribs upstairs mm -hmm. classical music and say that the flashlight went off on that. That was pretty. Yeah. John, are you the red-headed kid that we see in the stairwell? Can you light something up? Light one of bite. Them? Huh? Bite. Did I say it? She said light? Bite. 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 Is bite or a scratcher? Bite or a scratcher. I was asking questions downstairs in the basement for his name. Baby. I wonder if John is the biter and scratcher's name. Can you bite one of us? John, is that, is that what they reference you as? The Please. Biter and scratcher. If it is, can you turn a light on for us to confirm that? That was right on point. That's the second time we've asked about John referencing John and we got that. And it hasn't really gone on or anything since, so. Okay, John. Rules. Did you not did you not obey the rules? Is that why you kind of You didn't yeah, you didn't like the rules here? John, are you the biter? 
or scratch her, light up the light, confirm it. John, how old were you when you died? Did you see that? There's the piano and then like a chorus singing. What'd you get? Ocean ball. Ocean ball? Nice. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. And K2 went That's K2. The K2 was both up, yeah. That one looked like orange, dude. Turn. And the flashlight's on. John, is this you communicating with us? Can you touch that teddy bear that's on the podium? We're gonna have a good time. Have a good time. Turn on that teddy bear. <laughs> I will have a great time, please. First time in six months. We'll let you keep the damn thing. Can you make something out? Can you light something else up, please? That you can give us an indication. You Under? A chance to light up that teddy bear, please. Something, anything. Can the preacher come to his podium and light that teddy bear up? Can you give us a service? Can you make that run ball go off, please? Just gotta get close to the antenna. All it's gonna do is trigger it to make some noise and light up. Fun. Baby. Every time, like John. Baby boy. I wonder if John was the name of the baby boy. Oh, 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 oh. Did you hear Did that? Somebody else not hear that. I heard something. It was a ooh. Mm -hmm. Something's missing, like brushing my hairs on my arm right here. Somebody yeah. fall. Did you guys hear that again? Somebody hear that one. Oh, can you please come down and touch the wall with the first step, please? Please. Change. Was somebody just Ooh. touching? With the power. Right to there. Keep going. Keep going, please. You're gonna keep going, moving around. Keep going up. Why? Scary. Yeah. Don't be scary. Tell me. Don't be scary. You can go all the way up to the REM pod if you want to pop it with the K2 spike. Big time. Finally. The teddy bear finally went off. Finally. The REM pod. Finally, action, man. Flashlight, it's just going crazy. Can you touch that teddy bear again, please? Come closer because I know my legs off. That's the first time in six months we've got the teddy bear to go off. Middle AM. It's like all of them were dude. It was bam, bam. Yeah. Second. Can you please do that? Works. Can you please do that? Power. Yes. Use your power. Use our energy. You can use it to manipulate our devices, please. Money. I think they used all their energy on that one out first. If I Listen, can. I can't disagree any more than that. It's taken us a long time to get something like that to happen. It hasn't happened all night. 
It started with the motion balls. They were traveling up. Let me. K2 teddy bear, first time in six months that thing's gone off. And then it finalized on the top of the steps with the REM pod. Spite. You cannot ask for much more than what they just given us right there. So for me, that's a hell of a wrap right there. It was a great session, and I appreciate all they did for us.